Alrighty guys, here we are. We have made it to LAX, Los Angeles International Airport. Next up, Bowling Green, Kentucky, home of the Corvette. Well, Nashville, and then we're gonna do the rest of the journey um, on foot or no, by car. I'm not gonna wanna miss this one. So you know what, let's get there. This is it, we have made it to Nashville. The next stop is a get a rental car to finish off the journey to Bowling Green, Kentucky. This close, this close, so much in shock right now. This is the ultimate Corvette ever made, 670 horsepower, flat plane crank supercar. I got to get a breather and uh, let's get in the rental car and then get going to finish off this journey. Okay. Welcome to Tennessee. Oh, it's on. <laughs> It is the National Corvette Museum. Look how epic it looks in its scale. Our car is right there inside. It's so close. It's 2 a.m. and there's already a Corvette outside. Two Corvettes outside of the hotel. Another Corvette down there, the high spoiler. More Corvettes. There's Corvettes everywhere here. Maybe they know that we're here for delivery day. When I was your last time, we didn't have any Corvettes in the parking lot. So looking around us right now, let's check out the fellow brethren over here. What does it say? Official Pace Car? Here we go. What is that? Official Pace Car Corvette Racing? Oh my gosh. Then we have another, well, a CA Corvette to its right, a C7. Um, another C7, is that a, a Grand Sport or a Z06? Congrats to you because this looks nice. We, we gotta check out this front fascia covering that is on this uh, CA Corvette because um, th this would really help me for the cross country drive because uh, I don't want to get any damage. Please let me know in the comment section down below what kind of a uh, covering is this? on the front end. It looks like a really good idea. They are thinking smart. Anyways, let me go ahead and uh, park the amazing Volkswagen, Volkswagen Passat. Get a nice rest and wake up and check out the plant. Guess what that is? That's over here. When you buy a new Corvette and you get the museum delivery experience, you actually get a free plant tour. Is that what we're doing tomorrow? Well, you're gonna find out what we're gonna do, but uh, let me uh, fast forward till tomorrow. Welcome to the home of the Corvette GM Bowling Green Assembly. Today's hours are uh, closed, unfortunately, but uh, to the left says receiving gate six, purple docks, yellow docks. Been here once before when I took delivery of my uh, 2020 C8. It was a ton of fun, and straight down that way is where you see the plant, the main uh, front entrance area where you can see cars parked outside. It's actually hitting me now, it really is, because we're here at home of the Corvette to take delivery of the greatest Corvette ever made, in my opinion, and I know so many of you are so excited right now. I mean, like, my, my, my DMs, everyone's texting me, and it's getting hard to get back to everybody because with the traveling and trying to get the content and then arranging everything, Thing. It's getting pretty difficult, but rest assured we are doing it and today I do want to announce what time what time frame we're picking up the Z06 so you can actually watch live I'll, I'll touch base on that shortly once I get next to the NCM the National Corvette Museum May Maybe we can get a sneak peek of the car before the weekday starts where we uh, drive away Let me get over there first and then we'll continue this conversation. Let's go all right, all right, here we go, here we go. McDonald's, first thing in the morning, 7 a.m. or so. Uh, we have an interesting dilemma choice ahead of us. So let me show you. Okay, just got out of the Volkswagen, and what do we have here? So, uh, to, to my left, it says uh, Motorsports Park. I, I believe that is the uh, racetrack, the National Court Museum racetrack, and then Bowling Green, uh, so to the right, this way, that is the official museum. Way down there is where we're taking delivery of the new Z06, but you know what, actually? Are those are those Z06s? Got a C6 that just drove by, gave us a honk. So cool, I think they're actually on track today. Let me um, go ahead and go to the track ASAP, but I do wanna 
Check out what, what's over here. Whoa, no way. Oh my gosh. We've actually got Z06s outside. They have the uh, the wrap on the sides, uh, two torch red ones, a few uh, high wing spoilers slash Z07s. Oh my gosh! I don't see my car though. There, I don't. I don't see my car. I wonder. I wonder where it is. It must be. It must be inside. Let's stop by the racetrack because I'm a track guy. Even though it's a great seeing those right there. Let's let's circle back. Whoa! That's what I need outside my garage. Oh my gosh! This is so cool out here driving around. Um, um, the landscape near the factory, but let me go and pull in National Corvette Museum Motorsports Park turning in got the apex tracking out look at this place having an actual racetrack across the street from your factory that shows you how Serious the Corvette team is when it comes to the performance of their vehicle So this is part of the museum the museum being next to the factory as well It just all comes to highlight how amazing and evolving the Corvette experience really is as an owner or just an enthusiast Let's pull on in try to see what's going Going on over here to the right are different cars um, staged and ready to go I think you go on track Corvettes everywhere it'll be so cool to bring the Z06 here now obviously obviously I can't track it until we follow the 1500 mile break-in period but we can still like show up and represent with it not you know driving on track fast and driving on track in general but for people to see it and that'll be a really fun thing to do, I think. There's a 500 mile break-in period until the RPM opens up, but we'll touch base on that when we start driving away. Alrighty, locking up the amazing Volkswagen Passat. Hopefully I pronounced that correctly, but uh, the lineup looks pretty good. Torch red, uh, an orange, the Amplify orange, it could be. This track, never actually been to the paddock here and even seen the track in person. I've seen YouTube videos on it. It does have a DB limit, which I'm not sure how will affect the uh, Z06. It's a very loud car. I like it that loud because, uh, hey, it's an of an era, isn't it? Look at the graphics, the livery on the C8. What do you think? Should we try doing like a racing livery on the Z06? Who's faster? What do you think? Red or hypersonic gray? Comment down below. <laughs> Check out this GT4, you gotta see how many tracks that the owner's been on. I mean, like, this thing is actually used, and it's so awesome seeing owners appreciate their car for what it's designed for, and this is getting me very excited for what, what we plan on doing with the new Z06. Okay, this is it. We have made it to the National Corvette Museum. Let's see if we can get a sneak peek, but wow, this place is so special. Right behind me. Uh, today, I'm not really taking the keys, but I want to see if we can get a sneak peek of the car, maybe, in the delivery department. I was just bringing back so many memories. I was here two years ago, taking delivery of my 2020 C8 Stingray, and now we're back with the Z, the first ever Z, Z06. Are we going to see it on Corvette Boulevard? Coming in as we speak, opening up. Okay, this is it. We have made it to the main delivery area. I'm told that over here is the PDI department, so, so maybe, maybe we can see the car out back. I think I do see it this way. Um, I can catch a really big wing or spoiler in the distance, and looking around us, these are all stingrays, and in the back left corner, if I zoom all the way in, yep, that's it. That, that, that's got to be the car way down there. I can't see too much. It's an amazing teaser, I gotta say. Uh, we can see the uh, the racing stripe on the carbon fiber steering wheel, the carbon roof. Oh my gosh, it, it's the only um, Z06 right now in the entire PDI department. So yeah, we got the first ever delivery for a new Z06, not any Z06, one with the Z07 package, the track pack, the upgraded suspension, also the carbon fiber wheels with the retuned uh, steering feel. It, it's got all, all the options and I'm like, uh, I'm so hyper right now. I'm, I'm like, I'm, everyone's probably staring at me and coming in so much noise, but maybe if you're watching on the webcams right now, I'll, I'll wave to you guys. Here we have a uh, rapid blue uh, C8 Stingray hardtop convertible uh, being delivered soon. It's all protected for the owner, which is super cool. It is a Stingray. Ray R edition and um, all together with the rapid blue and the blue matched interior and the hardtop and the black well, carbon flash accents 
I do like this spec. So congratulations if this is your car. Hey, I'm giving you a sneak peek right now on the weekend. Okay, you know what, so that, that's just a sneak peek for now. Stay tuned for the official video coming very, very shortly. But here's the game plan. They're gonna pull it out of the PDI department, park it in one of these bays, and you can watch it live. There are tons of webcams all throughout the uh, the walls of the building. I'm not sure which bay we will be in, but you, you will see it um, through the main camera down, down the middle, and then you can choose the right number and then watch the entire experience live. Unfortunately, there'll be no audio, so you gotta stay tuned for the video. It's gonna be a cool like, like behind the scenes experience in the moment, seeing us uh, film the content and uh, just, just get the keys and drive out. I can't believe it's right there, it's right there. The other thing I wanted to announce is that if you wanna see our Z06 in person, I'll be here. So if you wanna come out to check it out when I exit the amazing Corvette tunnel where the journey begins, be here. The delivery process will be right around 7.45 a.m. They don't officially open till about 10 a.m. So expect us to roll out um, right around 10 o'clock. So if you wanna be here when we roll out, that'll be super cool. Right here, the first ever Z06 will be exiting the National Corvette Museum. And I would absolutely love it to see you come out and check out the car and meet so many of you. Let's face it, we're all super pumped and uh, hey, I wanna extend this experience to you as far as I can go. So if you want to see it for the day that we actually drive it away from the museum, you can do that. And then I'll be here till about 12 o'clock. So if you're interested in coming out, please, please do. In summary, this Tuesday, November 8th is when it all happens. And the website that you want to go on is gonna be the National Corvette Museums. And then find their um, webcam tab. I'll link it down below. So 7.45 a.m. is when I'll be getting here to a start the whole process. I'll be exiting right here, 10 o'clock. So come out, come out, be a ton of fun. I'll be here till 12, and then I'll do m many more of these uh, pit stops uh, along the whole cross country drive. I think I'll go Route 66, that'll be a ton of fun, but stay tuned on our Instagram, that being speed underscore phenom for all the updates. Thanks for watching this video, if you liked it, make sure to hit that like button to help me out and subscribe for much more great content coming out your way. I'll see all of you in the next episode.